Well, Jarvis, Double jab right that. hand there from Jarvis right away. Straight in. Oh, big shots already from Jarvis. I don't like the way that Gibbs taken some of these shots already. Well, Jarvis set out his stall. He came out throwing the bombs, looking to disrupt the rhythm. We know Gibb is a five-round fighter. Sometimes it does take him a little bit to heat up. Jarvis starts quick. So that might be a story we want to keep our eye on during this fight. Jarvis may start this fight quick, but Gibb's going to be around unless Jarvis can put him down. Oh. Big oh. shot. The right landed again cleanly. He's finding a home for him. Gibb's going to have to show a little bit more variety in his, not only in his defense, but in his jab, right? He pumps that jab out, but he doesn't do it enough downstairs and up. I want to see some variety this time. Stop! Stop! Back. I've got to be honest, uh, I know okay. the tension, we saw the tension in the air, we saw the stare down. I didn't think the pace would start so frantically in this bout. And you know what? Watching it, it's, it's funny you use the word frantic. Gibbs got a lot of, of, of happy feet right now, right? The feet are moving always, which is a good thing. But look at the stoic stance of Jarvis here. Very much planted, plotting forward, melodic stance, but continuing to move in exchanges. It's energy conservation of the two. Right, only used when needed. Double jab there from Jarvis, but it's not a lot of overexertion so far, which is good, because again, we're here for five. That's a nice combination from Gibb. Again, nothing landed cleanly yet from Gibb, but he's finding a home on his jab. He's trying to work off that to get to range. They're bubbling nicely at the moment. Three minute rounds, five of them. Looking for a big overhand there, Skid. Off that jab, he's gonna throw one around the guard. We do know that Jarvis keeps a very high guard, but he keeps it pretty tight. So the idea, it looks like, at least from Team Gibb, is to throw that jab to the body and then work around the guard. Overhands, hooks, things like that. You mentioned the busy nature of Gibb. Oh, there's one. The right hand landed, and he turned nicely again, Gibb, to keep the pressure on. I was just about to credit the footwork of Jarvis. It's impressing me. And then Gibb did that nice little turn off the line and kept the pressure on. Absolutely. You're going to see some of the highest levels we have in the culture box with both of these two. Oh, watch the heads there, boys. Oh, yeah. The head clash is definitely something we don't want. But again, you're looking at Gibb go around the guard. He's settled down that way. Yeah, he's yeah. Settled down. He's starting to settle into this fight, which I thought we would see. As the round and the fight goes on, Gibb is going to settle in. And that motor, as we know, just does not stop. Jarvis dropping the hands there, looking for the right to the body. Oh, it's a nice right hand. It gets through there from Gibb again. Jarvis has to get back on that jab. Yeah, the last half nice minute, he's just been out of range. Just a bit, just a bit. Now Gibbs teeing off a little. Bobby and Pat Gibbs.